welcome to my channel today I'm going to show you how to trade with candlestick psychology let's start so this is hard cat chart the trend is downtrend here and the minor trend is uptrend okay I'm going to place your lower option okay I place your lower option because I am seeing a small downtrend here and the market is moving like this red green red green so we can expect sellers entry from this level that's why I placed here a lower option okay very strong seller center and there is a level here okay there is a rejection too from buyers so we can expect buyers entry from this level okay I'm going to place here a higher option oh. okay I placed here a higher option because I'm seeing a rejection this is a level previously it worked as a support and resistance level and there is a buyer's entry so we can expect buyer's entry from this level and the market is moving like red green red green still so we can expect buyer's entry from this level that's why I placed here a higher option but a little bit late entry because of fast momentum ok a strong buyer entry so we can expect again a buyer entry at least for one minute because of this strong buyer entry okay very fast momentum Okay, very fast momentum it's better to place my trade on the next candle not here so actually I want to place here a I wanted to place here a higher option but very strong seller's entry it's my like it's my luck okay very strong seller's entry again Okay, I'm going to place a lower option. Okay, I placed your lower option because the sellers tried very strongly but failed. Again, it tried very strongly. So the sellers may continue. The market may break this movement here. That's why I placed here a lower option. Okay, let's see what happens here. Okay, we are seeing buyer center still. we are seeing here also there is a here also there is a type of consolidation area so if the market will be a, in consolidation area I may lose this trade okay okay I win this trade because of my entry point okay. 59, 59 okay. okay I'm going to place here a higher option okay I placed here a higher option because I'm expecting the buyers will continue because of this weak candle so the buyers will continue at least to this level so if the buyers will continue the next candle will go down okay because of this strong buying pressure the buyers may continue at least for one minute okay we have five seconds okay this is a winning trade okay till now I placed 5 trades all are winning trades 
this is my last trade I placed only four trades because with twenty dollars I made two hundred profit it's enough I don't need to trade one more trade I don't need to place one more trade again so this is my first trade because of this pattern the market is moving like this this is my second trade because of this same pattern and because of this level the trend also obtained there is a rejection the rejection is showing us the buyer center in the market and this is my third trade because of this strong seller entry but I I win this trade because of my entry point if I enter here it may give me loss in trade but I enter here because of my luck this is my fourth trade because of this weak candle okay actually the market is moving like this red green red green red green but at this area we are seeing a weak candle the weak candle is showing us the the weak candle is telling us the market is not following this pattern so the market may break this pattern that's why I placed here a higher option okay thank you for watching my video if you like my video like share and subscribe okay I'm going to withdraw some money in front of you because I got Uh, 200 profit 128 plus 107 is equal to okay I think I got 210 dollars 220 dollars profit it's very huge amount I'm going to withdraw my money I will show you my drawl also here okay you no need to trade every candle I am explaining here by trading every candle to know the logic behind the candlestick and to know the psychology of the candle I'm not recommending you to trade every candlestick wait for the right moment and place your trade you no need to place your trade on every candlestick okay I'm trying three hundred dollars here okay now I have only fifty dollars fifty one dollars in my account okay this is my withdrawal here already I have withdrawn one fifty dollars this is my yesterday and this is my previous yesterday day before yesterday withdrawals you can check my withdrawals also here I have withdrawn some amount daily only my daily target is only 100 to 150 dollars sometimes if market is good I will make more than 150 dollars you can see these are my withdrawals sometimes I will withdraw only 50 dollars per day too it depends upon the market situation I don't trade on every day if market is good I will trade if market is not good I don't trade okay always trade like this with some experience practice it on demo account if you get some good results then trade on real account if you don't get any good results then don't trade on real account always practice on demo account to get experience thank you for watching my video if you like my video like share and subscribe